Hello guys, I'm very excited to be filming that video today. Um, this is going to be an autumn what robe essentials. I have many things to show you and many things that I enjoy wearing during that season. And needless to say that autumn is like my favourite season. I love the fact that it's still warm, it's still sunny, but you begin to have colder days and rainy days as well and I like that season because I feel like it's it allows me to wear more things and to have more combinations of things okay starting with that combination that outfit so I'm not sure that it's that it is uh, perfect together these two pieces but let's start with the top so this is a long sleeve cashmere top it's ultra light it's actually a brand new piece and not a second hand one i know it's quite bad but i couldn't find it on vintage i was very disappointed so as i really like these kind of tops i wanted to get my hands on them so I had to go to the store and buy them. I feel quite bad, but I'm making efforts for everything else, so. I also have this top in three other colors. I have the a black one, a simple black one, which is quite sheer, so have to be careful, I may have to buy a nude bra to wear under that. I also have, oh, that one is upside down. I also have the khaki one, the sage green one, I might say. And this is sheerer, is that even a word? This is sheerer than the black one. So yeah. I know if a nude bra is sufficient, or perhaps I might have to buy a new top, a new you know, strap, spaghetti strap top thing. I also own that top in the. Sorry, I'm very bad folding my clothes currently. I also have the same one, but an A marine dark blue shade with the glitters all over the all over oh the glitters all over it and this one is quite opaque so just in case i chose to wear i'm choosing to wear a nude bra under that or a black bra but because the depth transparency is not that bad the sheerness is not that bad they're very comfy very classy and you can combine them with skirts or pants or trousers you have many options and i do feel like they're good for the warm days that begin to be cold if you know what i mean and i am wearing the top with these trousers um they give grandpa vibes but i love them um i bought them on vintage they are from the brand froggy and as you can see they are in very bad condition um i mean the bottom is missing and this iron to tear tear apart in the middle but i love wearing that it's very comfy it's white white legged and yeah, I do like wearing comfier pants and loose pants, oversized ones. I have another one that I enjoy wearing in that style. I need to buy more, more of these. Uh, so that one is from Bershka. It's giving nothing at the moment, I'm sorry. But it was very famous. Uh, at the beginning of the year or perhaps last year not sure but 
yeah it used to be very famous and i bought it on vinted um it's uh, like camel color camel color beige color and yeah it's from Bershka, but i got it on vinted for a cheaper price what i enjoy is that it's very tight on the waist and i enjoy cinching my waist up for that one uh, because it was too large for me i had to you know do the trick where do that you know but i can't do that anymore i actually tried omitted to find these pants in other colors like in the black obviously in the black one but it's very hard to find Moving on to thicker materials, um, I bought that one on Vinted as well, it's from Zara, Zara. and it's uh, a baby blue, light blue kind of thing, and it's very pretty because it has a ruched um, décolleté. Yeah, at the moment I'm trying to buy more pieces with uh a rouge detail on them because yeah it's something that i have my eye on for a while i have a similar top um it's not giving anything right now it's um thick material as well not as thick as um a sweater you know and it's sweater but it's still thicker than the cashmere tops that i showed you before um, this is from Bershka and it's uh, a white ribbed um, material and it's uh, quite cropped. Here is another one in a brownie orangey shade, camely shade. Uh, this one was from ASOS but like the uh, previous things that I showed you, uh, it's from Vinted. It was not that expensive. Yeah, it has... Uh, type uh, décolleté as well it's kind of flattering and it's still warm not too warm for autumn for the warmer days of autumn yeah in the same style but with uh, longer sleeves uh, you have that top that I I can't remember the brands that I bought on Vinted. It's a bodysuit, so it's tight on the waist, which I like. And I do feel like the tight versus large combo, like when you wear a tight top with batch pants, it goes along well. Or on the contrary, when you wear tight pants with a large top it can be a good combination as well but my preference is tight top wide leg pants or oversized pants it's a uh, white cream color and the sleeves are very cool they give um, vampire vibes or Duchesse vibes. The décolleté is very flattering as well, this one. Moving on to skirts, I have one to show you. Uh, this is a skirt that I bought on Vinted. It was from ASOS, I think. It's a denim one, it's quite long and it has a grey colour. It's very nice. I do enjoy the button details at the bottom and I felt like jumping on the train 
for the trend of denim skirts, long denim skirts because they are flattering and this is a trend that I like. I do prefer wearing darker colours, that's why I chose to get a greyish denim skirts because you know you can get blue ones which look like denim a bit better but in my opinion at least I do have less trouble of combining a duck pants a duck yeah duck pants or duck trousers or, or duck skirt duck skirt with something else at the top I'm very bad with blue pants now I'm very excited for that one um a full leather jacket let me show you Ooh. this outfit is quite nice yeah so this is a full leather jacket uh, it has it's sage green kind of and it's very comfy it's from asus design but i bought it on vinted like many other things that i buy now and yeah it's very nice it's oversized it goes well with a, a denim skirt i'll try to show you if i had to do a list of the things i enjoy wearing the most Kind of leather jackets would be in the first position or yeah close to the first position that one i own since 2019 or 2018 or something oh it's quite oh I'm not sure about this, this combo but yeah i'm not sure about that one it's, i feel like it's too long for the long denim skirt underneath but was just to show you how it looks like worn. It's a leather jacket that I own thanks to my brother because it was supposed to be given to him, but it doesn't like this kind of jacket. So I got it instead. That's why I love autumn. It allows me to wear this jacket and leather jackets and I couldn't be happier to be honest. I I, pref I usually wear that jacket with trousers or other type of pants but yeah I do feel like with that, with that skirt it's not a great combo but well, at least you could go well with a shorter skirt. Now I have two pairs of shoes to show you. The first one is obviously a pair of loafers, platform loafers. And these ones are I've worn many 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 times because as you can see on that one, on the left one, it's starting to tear apart and I don't have the glue to repair it so Either I buy new ones from Vinted or I buy glue and I manage to repair them. So I actually got them in a store. It was like the store that you have in France. It's a chaussure and doesn't have a, really a brand. It's a donor. Luna. Yeah, but I enjoy wearing them in autumn with uh, oversized trousers or even a skirt. They're very pretty and outstanding. Next, I wanted to show you these boots. As you can see, they have uh, a cowboy boot vibe and a, a heel and a platform everything that i like combined the shoe i actually bought them on the website koi 
quite footwear uh, because like two years ago I bought on that website a pair of platform boots that I worn to death and they are now dead as you can imagine that's why I've been thinking on getting a new pair from their website because it was good quality and they had they have good designs and funky designs that I like and they are vegan so that's why I bought them and I've been wearing them a lot since I think that I bought them last month I hope that it inspired you to buy more things secondhand because as you could see many of the things that I showed you come from Vinted but you also have the app Depop to find things second hand but if I remember well Depop tends to be more expensive than Vinted now you can find Vinted in the UK I'm not sure but it's uh, very known in France so and very known in uh, European countries as well like a Belgium or Denmark or Italy or Spain obviously the delivery is not that good for the environment but when I buy on Vinted sometimes I try to buy many things at once from the same seller so it limits the impact of the delivery on the environment but yeah I'm done filming the video and showing you the things I love I'll see you in a future video. Goodbye.